Hello everyone and welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today's topic is how to insert rows and columns in your Google Sheet online. If you're interested in the video, be with us till the end. Open your Google Sheet account. Just open it through your web browser. As you see, I've already made a table. This was an old table that I got. So uh, now what we'll do is just go to this insert tab as you can see at the taskbar. Click on it. Go to rows. Insert one row above and insert one row below. These two options will be available. So click on insert one row above. And generally they'll insert one row at the top of all the other rows because we have not selected any specific row to insert it on. Now go to the insert option again, click on the row section, insert one row below. So when you tap on it, because the box was on the first row, now it has been inserted here on the other row. Click on the insert tab again. Now we'll insert columns. Insert one column left. Click on it. And as you can see, a column has been inserted at the left side. To put it on the right side, we'll just click on insert one column to the right. And now, as you can see, the first time the box, the active box was here. And now when we added another one to the right, it got here. Now to do it specifically, let me just clear it all out for you. Now, for example, we have to insert a row here. So let's just go to insert a uh, one row below and a row has been inserted specifically at this position, below this position. Now, if we click here and the active box is here, go to insert tab and go to rows, insert one row above. When you click on it, as you can see, the row has been inserted above. So to do the columns like this specifically, let's just get the active head here, go to insert, go to columns, one to the left, insert one column left, and one column has been inserted to the left of this column as this was the active head. You can do the same method for inserting a column at the right. So for that, let's take another column first. Let's go here. Let's take this one. Um, well, let's take this one. Now go to insert one to the left, to the right. We have done left one, so insert it. As you can see, a column has been inserted. Let's clear it all out now so that you don't get confused. There is another method too, like if you don't want to keep on going to insert again and again and clicking on these tabs, what you can do is if you want to insert a row here, for example, just click on it, click at the right tab. And from here, you can directly insert one row above, insert one column left. You can directly click on these. So it's a bit easier, that's it. Like if we click on insert one row above, then a row will be added above automatically. You can repeat the same method to insert a row below or to insert a column to the left. And as you can see, if you repeat it, you can even delete the row and delete the column from the same section just by clicking, just by clicking on right. After you do the right click, you'll get these options. Now let's try it here. Right click, insert one column above, and it'll be inserted. Let's do it here. Right click, insert one. That was row. Uh, insert one column to the left and that's done let's clear it out thank you for being with us till the end 
If you like the video or if the video was helpful, do not forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon below so that you get notified each and every single time we upload a new video for you. Thank you.